Officers encountered a male subject, later identified as 38-year-old Joseph Moreno. Joseph Moreno had an extensive criminal history. It includes arrests for armed robbery, aggravated burglary, multiple drug arrests and convictions, and multiple counts of possession of a firearm by a felon and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. The DOC says he got out of prison in February 2015 for time served, but right after that he was busted again. Court records show in March police charged him with driving on a suspended license. Those same charges again in May and June. Then in August, police charged him with drug possession in September, leaving the scene of an accident and failure to render aid. In that case, he pled no contest to failure to give notice of an accident and driving on a revoked license. In December, police arrested him for aggravated burglary, battery, and drug possession. When they went to pick him up today... Joseph Moreno had three active warrants for his arrest. Investigators say police and Moreno exchanged gunfire. Moreno died at the scene. He not only had tattoos on his face, but the Department of Correction says he had multiple other tats on his body. Some of them said Diablo, Demon, and Graveyard, and there were multiple faces of women. Back to you.